Albi Media is an extremely common media formulation if we want to grow an E. coli or other bacteria in the lab. Albi Media is a very very common, cheap and cost effective way to grow microbes in the lab. Let's go to the recipe. Tripton is a digest of a protein known as casein that is most abundantly present in the milk. Tripton serves as a source of amino acid residue for bacteria. Next, we have yeast extract. Yeast extract contains all of the nutrients required for the growth of bacteria. Next, we have got NaCl. Microbes in particular use NaCl as a way to balance osmolites in the medium. Means not too much salty, not too much wet. So, in this experiment, we will demonstrate the preparation of liquid albi media to initiate bacterial culture in a shaking cloth. For the next step, we need an analytical weighing balance. Place the weigh board onto the balance pan. Press the tear key to zero out the weighing board. Now use the lab scoop to add 1 gram of Tripton, 1 gram of NaCl and 0.5 gram of yeast extract. This is 1 gram of Tripton. Add 1 gram of NaCl. is 1 gram of NaCl Now add 0.5 gram of yeast extract.
This is 0.5 gram of yeast extract. Now add the mixture of powder containing 1 gram of Krypton, 1 gram of NaCl and 0.5 gram of yeast extract to the beaker. Use a magnetic stirrer to stir the solution so that all of the visible clumps will have been broken down. Place a beaker on a magnetic stirrer. Allow the solution to stir. After stirring the solution, transfer the media to Allen Mayer flask. This is Allen Mayer flask. It is commonly known as a conical flask. Cover the flask with aluminium foil. Place a piece of autoclave tape over the foil and label it with the media name. Use autoclave to sterilize the solution. Back to the bench, allow the media to cool down. In order to grow bacteria in large amount or in higher density, we use liquid LB media. So we have to inoculate the culture into liquid LB media. So first what we will do, we take inoculating loop, we will sterilize it by putting it on the flame. When it turns red hot, sterilization done. This is a culture of E. coli. We will pick the colonies of the bacteria E. coli with the help of inoculating loop and will mix it in a liquid broth media. After sterilizing the loop, cool it for a bit and pick the colonies of the bacteria.
Now place the flask into the shaking incubator for overnight growth. This is a shaking incubator. We will place the flask into the shaking incubator for overnight growth at 37 degree C for 24 hours. Press the start button to allow it to shake. After 24 hours, we will stop the shaking incubator and observe the flask. We will observe the turbidity in the solution which clearly shows the growth of the bacterial colonies.